Toyota's insane new engine shocks the entire car industry. We all know our fair share of automobile companies, but none has the hearts of people around the world like Toyota has. Toyota has always focused on durability, ease of repair, and readily available low-cost parts. However, Toyota is not content with simply putting their products on the market with some engine. They want to put their best foot forward to outperform their competitors. Toyota is one of the world's most well-known automobile manufacturers. It is quite evident from the fact that despite the COVID-19 pandemic and chip scarcity, the corporation sold approximately 10.5 million cars during the period when the entire industry struggled. It's time to take a closer look at how Toyota's engines have evolved and learn a little more about what makes Toyota a top car maker. Toyota has modified their engine designs to improve thermal efficiency by focusing on how to speed up the combustion process. They focused on developing a better engine by improving thermal efficiency because it results in an increased torque and horsepower. And it is this focus that has earned Toyota a lot of attention for their dynamic force engine strategy. Their dynamic force engine strategy is built around increased thermal efficiency. The amount of energy produced when a combustion engine burns fuel in relation to the amount of that energy converted into mechanical energy is referred to as thermal efficiency. To appreciate this new engine, it's critical to understand gasoline thermal efficiency. The phrase refers to the percentage of potential energy in gasoline converted into power that can be used to move your car. Internal combustion engines accomplish this by spraying a fine mist of gasoline mixed with air into the cylinders, squeezing it into as small a space as possible, and lighting it with a spark. When it ignites, it explodes, causing the pistons to re-emerge with incredible force, turning the crankshaft, which is connected to the transmission, connected to the drive shaft, which is connected to the wheels, with various parts and gears in between directing and controlling the power to ensure the wheels turn but not spin. However, the above-mentioned configuration has a flaw. Some power is lost during combustion due to friction and extra heat. For the average gasoline combustion engine, this results in thermal performance of around 3-5%. Engineers have been working tirelessly for over a century to reduce energy waste and convert as much energy and fuel to driving your car or running your air conditioner. Toyota engineers examined every stage of the engine cycle, looking for ways to make it more efficient in terms of gas savings and environmentally friendly. They then attempted to convert the saved gasoline into additional power, thereby improving thermal efficiency. Toyota drew inspiration from Formula One, a sport in which efficiency reigns supreme. In order to achieve high-speed combustion, three major modifications were made, which particularly aided Toyota in achieving high-speed combustion and ensuring that the air-fuel mixture burns completely, resulting in more power produced with each burst. Among the enhancements are the angle of the intake valve, laser-clad valve seats, and cylinder dimensions. The grade of the intake valve and the geometry of the intake port direct the air-fuel mixture within the cylinder in a specific pattern, causing it to combust more quickly and evenly, resulting in more power and less waste. Second, the laser-clad valve seats allow for optimal valve angle and airflow direction in the combustion chamber, resulting in tumble flow, a more regulated swirl pattern that distributes the air-fuel mixture more uniformly ahead of the compression phase. Third, a taller, narrower cylinder allows the igniting mixture to spread more quickly across the cylinder, resulting in a faster combustion moment and more force pushing the piston down, which results in more torque and efficiency. Toyota engineers didn't stop there. They also used tried-and-true techniques to improve the thermal efficiency of the new dynamic force engines. Toyota's D4S fuel injection technology combines direct and port injection to improve efficiency and smoothness during everyday driving. But only direct injection is used when maximum power is required. In the meantime, the pistons have a special surface that reduces friction. In conjunction with an electric water pump, an electronic thermostat manages temperature for maximum efficiency. Variable valve timing optimizes power versus efficiency, and a higher compression ratio further improves efficiency. 
These strategies yield the world best thermal efficiency of 41% in hybrid applications and 40% in gas only vehicles, increased torque and power at any engine speed, and improved fuel efficiency and emissions. Toyota's new dynamic force engine aids the company in its race for every tenth of a percent in efficiency. The 2.0-liter four-cylinder engine is mated to Toyota's latest six-speed manual transmission, which was designed with global demand in mind. Toyota is always determined to find a solution which is more aligned with current technology, along with setting sights on innovation to help bring the industry to new levels. Evidence for this would come from the fact that a few months back, Toyota asked Yamaha to create a naturally aspirated V8 engine that runs solely on hydrogen. In November of last year, Kawasaki Heavy Industries, Subaru Corporation, Toyota Motor Corporation, Mazda Motor Corporation, and Yamaha Motor Corporation announced that they would begin discussions to conduct collaborative research into possible avenues for expanding the range of fuel options for internal combustion engines in the quest for carbon neutrality. The V8 hydrogen engine shown above, developed by Yamaha for Toyota, was also unveiled to the public at the announcement venue. Even though the new engine isn't entirely new, the way it's powered is, the 5.0-liter naturally aspirated V8 engine is based on the engine found in the Lexus RCF coupe, but it has been modified in terms of injectors, heads, intake manifolds, and other components. Yamaha claims a horsepower of 444, 450 for its start at 6,800 revolutions per minute and 398 pound-feet, 540 newton meters of torque at 3,600 revolutions per minute. The clean gas guzzler is thus slightly less powerful than the traditional one, which produces 472 horsepower, 479 for its start, and 395 pound-feet, 536 newton meters when fitted to the RCF track edition but we'd gladly take the hit if it meant we could keep our V8 for a few more years. Takeshi Yamada, a Yamaha engineer, explained that the engine has a different personality than a traditional gasoline engine. Hydrogen engines have an innately friendly feel that makes them easy to use even without resorting to electronic driving aids. At this point, neither company has said anything about the technology hitting the market anytime soon, or for that matter, how would route the exhaust system connected to the bizarre top-mounted AQ? One exhaust manifold, which Yamaha claims produce a very distinct high-frequency sound. Toyota has been slow to embrace the idea of fully electric vehicles, despite the fact that it pioneered hybrid technology and CEO Akio Toyota made an impassioned speech about the era of prohibiting combustion engines. Carbon is not the internal combustion engine, our enemy. He said at a press conference held by the Japan Automobile Manufacturers Association JAMA. Yamaha has already pledged to become carbon neutral by 2050 and has been working on a hydrogen engine for cars for five years. Hydrogen engines have the potential to be carbon neutral while keeping their passion for the internal combustion engine alive, explained Yamaha Motor President Yoshihiro Bidaka. Toyota's current plan to grow is by partnering with companies with different corporate cultures and areas of expertise and increasing the number of partners who also have a strong passion for and level of commitment to the internal combustion engine. Toyota, on the other hand, has run a hydrogen-powered Corolla in Japan's Super Take You race series and also displayed a hydrogen-powered GR, Yaris prototype with the same technology, indicating that the company is clearly committed to the concept. These are all game-changing efforts made by a beloved car company, Toyota. It has always been a classic choice for all kinds of people, so it's exciting to see what new ventures they might take part in the future and see where the automobile industry is.